Welcome to another Guide You Outdoors video, where we guide you to an outdoor lifestyle. Welcome. Today, I'm gonna to do a review for you for the Granite Gear Dog Backpack. When it comes to dog backpacks, I think there's one brand that really stands above all the rest, and that's Granite Gear right here. Um, this pack is the Long Howl Dog Backpack. This is probably the top end model that they have. It has a frame that goes onto the dog, and then the pack itself can be removed from the dog. Um, this is about three days of food, which is I recommend never putting more than four or five days of food on your dog. You don't wanna overweight them, because um, you could cost them injuries. Another model right here, this is the Alpha Pack and this is a very loved backpack. Um, this backpack actually hiked the Appalachian Trail with me and my dog Sly. And great story about Granite Gear, I got about halfway down the trail, a thousand miles, you know, gear wears out and a hole blew out in the backpack. I called up Granite Gear, they immediately sent me a new backpack, which is this one I have here today still, um, still holding strong. This is a really quality, solid backpack, but it just goes straight onto the dog. There is no frame that comes with it. Great product, I'll show you how to put them on the dogs. All right, so now I'm gonna put my Long Howl backpack on my dog, Willie. Now, Willie weighs about 35 pounds, and I have for her the extra small, stay here, sweetie, the extra small backpack. And the way this one goes on, there's just a loop up front, real simple, you can slip that over the top, and then there's two straps that come underneath her belly. So you gotta get these around, and clipped in. And you wanna make sure these are on nice, especially after a long day of backpacking. If they're rubbing the wrong way, they could cause some chafing for it. Now you'll notice that this pack is sitting pretty nicely on her. As I said before, this is about three days of food, and that's all it really takes to strap on the backpack for. The nice part of this one as well is the removability of the pack part. So by just undoing these four clips here, let's say we're taking a little break, I can take the weight off of her, let her run around just in this harness, which isn't gonna bother her at all, and um, have a little break and take it off for her, or when we're back at camp. It's a great way. All right. Now Sly's ready to put his pack on too. This is my much larger. Sly weighs about 75 pounds when we hiked the Appalachian Trail. He was more about an 85 pound dog. And one thing I'll give a huge heads up on, this is a medium. You'd think this is a large dog right here. He he's, takes a medium dog backpack. I think they size them a little bit too large. Now this one, just like the other, slips over the head. And then it just has one strap that comes underneath the belly and is clipped on. And that's three days of food on him as well. And looks like we're ready to go backpacking. Sly, you wanna go? Oh, I'm too old to go backpacking, Dad. I'm too old to go backpacking. Dad. All right. So I liked my Granite Gear dog backpack so much that I said, I need a backpack for my other pet. Hey, Pooh, you need a backpack too. Here you go, buddy. Granite Gear for you. Let's go backpacking, Pooh. <laughs> so Granite Gear dog backpacks, we got the Long Howl, Ow! and the Alpha for the top dog. Great backpacks, both of them work really well. I recommend either one if you're looking for a good backpack for your dog. Thanks for watching. If you want to watch more videos, remember to subscribe to our YouTube page and like us on Facebook.